propagation of sound. Sound is produced by vibrating objects. The matter or substance through which sound is transmitted is called a medium. Now this medium can be solid, liquid or gas. Sound moves through a medium from the point of generation to the listener. When an object vibrates, it sets the particles of the medium around it vibrating. The particles actually do not travel all the way from the vibrating object to the ear. What happens is that a particle of the medium in contact with the vibrating object is first displaced from its equilibrium position. It then exerts a force on the adjacent particle. As a result of which, the adjacent particle gets displaced from its position of rest. After displacing the adjacent particle, the first particle comes back to its original position. This process continues in the medium on and on and on till the sound reaches your ear. The disturbance created by a sound in the medium travels through the medium and not in the particles of the medium. Interesting, isn't it? Compression and Rarefactions Air is the most common medium through which sound travels. When a vibrating object moves forward, it pushes and compresses the air in front of it, creating a region of high pressure. This region is called a compression or C. This compression starts to move away from the vibrating object. When the vibrating object moves backwards, it creates a region of low pressure called rarefaction. As the object moves back and forth rapidly, a series of compressions and rarefactions is created in the air. These make the sound wave that propagates through the medium. Compression is the region of high pressure and rarefraction is the region of low pressure.